I have spoken to the CEO of campaign manager, as well as right now, John Haggerty, very high on the list. Mr. Palladino has indicated he's happy to meet with us in the Invisible Alliance of America over the next couple of days, hopefully before the Sunday's holiday. Mr. Palladino, through his campaign manager, has denied that he personally made a statement. Mr. Heikens himself referred to the fact that he was a supporter. This was done by opposition research. This is something they dug out of a Niagara paper from almost a, a year ago. Many, many months ago. The question over here is, not one of these usual cast of characters of political hats in the Orthodox community before abusing Palladino against anti-Semitism and being like Hitler, they never sat down to speak to him. Not one of them bothered to speak to him. Every single person here is listed in previous campaigns as supporting liberal Democrats. I would humbly suggest that if Andrew Cuomo thinks that Mr. Palladino is a, an anti-Semite, I think he owes it to us, the New Yorkers, to come out of the closet and he should say so instead of having these proxy people saying these things. This is totally ridiculous. The fact of the matter is, we in the Orthodox community are encouraged by the Palladino candidacy. We are outraged and embarrassed and ashamed of Sheldon Silver's support for partial birth abortions, which we in the Orthodox community consider baby killing. And not one of these rabbis, with all their beards and political connections, ever came and said, we oppose Sheldon Silver because he supports gay marriage. We oppose Sheldon Silver because he didn't allow AIDS babies to be tested under the Nettie Myerson Assembly Bill for years until it was on the front page of the New York Times. Sheldon Silver, I'm sorry to say, I'm embarrassed, but the man has blood on his hands. So if a Gentile person who has no political experience went a little overboard to say that he's not capable of being the doctor, Mr. Heikens himself basically said he's not allowed to use the word Hitler. Mr. Heikens himself said everything short of that the man is Hitler. He's violent to the record to generate all this political hyperbole. I'm embarrassed that my co-religions are so crazy. And you will see in the coming days and weeks, Mr. Palladino will explain himself and he's very attractive to the Orthodox and interreligious community. You will not allow the incitement, the raised voices, the hyperbole and melodrama to take away from what our Palladino stands for. The people are sick and tired. We don't, we don't consider five films remarks about two taxes and they can look at the same thing and someone is disgusting to show the silver has a body comment with tens of thousands of the that and millions of people and we need to see people about it.